For our announcements today, I'd like to begin by saying welcome to anyone who may be joining us for the first time online. If you would like to get into touch with us, you may email us, BethelSunValley at gmail.com, or call us. Our office number is 818-767-4488. For our prayer request today, please pay attention to uh, those requests that were sent out uh, from our office earlier this week. There are a number of um, different circumstances and situations that uh, deserve our prayer and our concern. Please uh, read through those and keep each of those different uh, families and individuals in your prayers. Here in Los Angeles County, the number of coronavirus cases is rising. So we ask that you continue to pray for our county, our leaders, our doctors, and our nurses, and especially for those who are sick at this time uh, with coronavirus and with every other illness um, that, that people are sick with at this time. But please be in prayer for them. And uh, please be in prayer also for our schools, um, those of us with kids have been tracking developments, hoping that schools will be able to reopen. As of Friday, it looks like they will not be able to reopen in August. So uh, that's very disappointing for families and for children, and for teachers and for uh, principals as well. So uh, please be in prayer for our school system, but especially for our children. Um, it would be wonderful if our kids would be able to go back to some form of in-person schooling, if not immediately on August 18, then perhaps sometime later in the fall. There are several opportunities to give that are listed in your announcement uh, email. We are encouraged to give to Bethel Church's Benevolence Fund. That's the fund that the deacons use to help people in our church and in our community. We're encouraged to give to ministry shares. Those funds support the work of the Christian Reformed Church in North America. We're also encouraged to support San Fernando Valley Rescue Mission. As you can imagine, I'm sure they are even more stressed now than they were before this pandemic started. So please uh, consider supporting them. And also Asilo Octagama, the elderly men's home in Tijuana. If you would like to give to any of those causes, you may write a check. You may bring an envelope with cash to our office. For the Benevolence Fund and the General Fund, you may use your Give Plus app to give. That's an app on your phone. Otherwise, of course, you are welcome to send a check. Okay, having shared those announcements and prayer requests, we're going to take some time now to listen to a song. As we listen, I encourage you to, to spend some time with God in prayer. And if you'd like, you may also use this time to give to one of the causes that I've mentioned. 